Let's go ahead and take a live look from Nashua, New Hampshire right now, where Jeb Bush and other presidential hopefuls are making their last-minute pushes there. And after a memorable debate over the weekend, Marco Rubio finds himself facing new attack. Here's NBC's Peter Alexander. Here in the Granite State, Donald Trump looking to solidify his lead, showcasing his schoolyard brand of toughness against rival Jeb Bush. Poor, poor, poor Jeb Bush who brings out his mother because he needed help. Mommy, please come walk in the snow, Mom. The latest attack after Trump defiantly barreled through booze on Saturday night. Property you, from an elderly talk, woman. Let me talk. Quiet. Help a lot of it. times. A lot of times. This morning, Marco Rubio is still trying his critics, after the freshman senator, already under fire for being too scripted, repeated the same rehearsed line four times. And let's dispel once and for all with this fiction that Barack Obama doesn't know what he's doing. This fiction that Barack Obama doesn't know what he's doing. This notion that Barack Obama doesn't know what he's doing. Rubio seemingly rattled with Chris Christie delivering the pounding. He knows exactly what he's doing. There it is, the memorized 25-second speech. Well, that's the, that's there the it is, everybody. Rubio's opponents quickly branding him as an untested robot, the episode taking on a life of its own. The candidate ignoring the ridicule, insisting his performance demonstrated message discipline, not a lack of depth. I would pay them to keep running that quick clip because that's what I believe passionately. Less than 24 hours to go, the Republican contenders today hitting the gas, trying to put Saturday night's backstage pile up in their rearview mirror. Candidates missing their cue, Jeb Bush passing Trump and Ben Carson by. Another forgotten entirely. Can I introduce so Kasich? in here. Yes, yes. We're going to introduce Ohio Governor John Kasich. <laughs> While presidential candidates spent the weekend